Welcome to the Cox3.com post-game show. The moon over San Juan Capistrano here at J. Sarah High School. What a Trinity League baseball game. The Santa Margarita Eagles come back to defeat the J. Sarah Lions 5-4. to four. And gentlemen, as you join me for the Cox3.com post-game show, the coach Bill Kennedy and the professor Paul Westfall. Coach, first let's talk about this performance. Both teams, another Trinity League battle. We saw great pitching by the Eagles tonight. Well, if you're a college recruiter or if you're a professional baseball scout, you come watch these things because yeah. the talent level is amazing. The coaching is as good as it is anywhere in the country, and we were treated to a great game tonight, a great comeback, a great start by the Lions, but I think two teams that can go deep in the playoffs. Yeah, Paul, we saw two great pitchers on the mound, Parker Joe Robinson for Jay Sarah and Griffin Canning for Santa Margarita, and they were dueling early. They both had their innings where they gave up a couple runs, but they were pretty solid tonight. Yeah, I would have to say as good as advertised, both these pitchers uh, getting through some very formidable lineups. But uh, Jay Sarah got off to an early start because Santa Margarita kind of threw it around a little bit. Yep. But I was uh, uh, very impressed with the resilient nature of the Eagles after being down 4 nothing. Yeah, three errors in the first couple innings for the Eagles. Let's take a look at the highlights of this one. And there were a few innings where the runs were coming. This is David Wenzel coming through with an RBI single as Jordan Steele comes up with a throw. And Jake Preeze is out at home, but they do get a run. It's one nothing after one. Bottom of the second, two nothing Jay Sarah. And Brady Shockey with first and third, one out, up the middle, one run scores. And error cost them another run. And Jay Sarah now up four to nothing after two. Top of the third, base is loaded for Santa Margarita's Dylan Miyashiro and the Double to the wall, cleans the bases, a three RBI double. Santa Margarita within one, down four to three. Two outs when Santa Margarita's number nine hitter in the top of the fourth, Drew Williams, goes deep. Boy, does he bounce ones off the street, and that ties the ball game at four. What a blast. Oh, I'll tell you, he got all of that one, uh, took an inside pitch, got his hands inside the baseball, and rocketed one over the left field fence, and you could just see the body language of the Eagles changed dramatically, and suddenly we're back even at four. Drew Williams' first home run of the season. Top of the seventh now, still tied at four. Griffin Canning helps himself with J.J. Carr at second. Canning singles up the middle, and Carr is safe, and the Eagles take a five to four lead. Bottom of the seven, Nick Meyer on in relief of Canning. He strikes out Christian Molfetta to end it with the winning run at first, the 13th overall strikeout by Eagles pitching. And there you see some of the performances uh, tonight, Coach. Well, I, I thought Mia Shiro did a great job 0-2 in the count to drive that ball to the wall and clear the bases. But I was so impressed with the J. Sarah team, which has so many young players, and they look like veterans. And I think the, the coaching David Bacani does at Santa Margarita and Brett Kay does here at J. Sarah is just second to none. And uh, this is as high a level of high school baseball as you're going to see anywhere in the country. J. Sarah gets the nine hits uh, to Santa Margarita's eight, but uh, clutch hits late in this game for Santa Margarita. Yeah, they, they showed their true colors. They're kind of a microcosm of the season for David Bacani's Eagles as they come back from a 4 nothing deficit to win a game against uh, perhaps the eventual uh, solo Trinity League champion, J. Yeah. Sarah Lions. But I think both teams have the potential to last a long time in the CIF playoffs because they have depth at the pitching staffs. They have some good clutch hitting and some real leadership. And this J. Sarah Lions team, a lot of sophomores and juniors out there, yeah. you better get the Lions this year. So Santa Margarita takes two of three from J. Sarah this league season. J. Sarah now 10 and three in league with two more games remaining. Santa Margarita eight and five with two left of the regular season. But like you mentioned, Paul and Coach, I think we're going to see these teams well into the playoffs. Great talent, a great ball game overall tonight here in the Trinity League on the Cox 3 game of the week. 5 for the final. The Santa Margarita Eagles defeat the J. Sarah Lions for the coach, Bill Kennedy, and for Paul Westfall. I'm Gordon Spencer. It was a battle in the Trinity League for two and a half hours, and the Eagles come through with a one-run victory, 5-4 to four, over Jay Sarah.